Hello, welcome, I'm Troy. This is Podcasting for Beginners, how to make a video podcast using the iMovie app on your phone, not on your desktop or MacBook, on your phone. I'm gonna keep this simple. Um, I'm gonna basically make a video podcast, a short one, and I'm gonna walk you through what I do so that you get an idea from step one, the very basic ingredients, all the way until it's in the oven and cooking and the final result. And along the way, there might be a few things that I cover in later videos, you know, tips or techniques or tricks or things like that. But I'll point those out. This is just a simple walkthrough so that you understand the basic idea of how to make a video podcast so that you can get it out there and get people watching. Let's do this. Okay, here is your phone. Just pretend it's your phone. And what we're going to do is start from the beginning. So you're going to need to make a video, right? You're making a video podcast. So let's just say you're going to use the video function on your camera app. So you open that up, right? And you uh, you can turn it around. Hey, look at that. And you want to switch it to video, of course. Ha ha ha, how's it going? You've got that. So, okay, let's say you film your video. You've got it in your photos. And let's open the iMovie app, wherever that is on your phone. So you open up the iMovie app. Now, here we are, and this is old videos that you can you can re-edit or a new one if you want to click the plus sign in the top left so just click on that and that'll bring up another option which is a movie uh, which is what we're going to do or a trailer a trailer is just like a template where you add things into it and it's always the same in terms of how it functions you can do that at a later point but we're going to make a movie now so click on movie and now we have the option to grab any video or photos now see the media in the top left you can go back and start with anything you want a video a photo whatever but let's let's go to video and all and we'll use um doesn't really matter let's use uh, this one so so here and then just click the little check mark you can even play it here a little bit if you want to double check if that's the one you want okay highlight it click check and at the bottom here, push Create Movie. So here's your movie. On the bottom, you have, in this part that's highlighted, um, you have where you edit. And then in the top is what it'll look like as a final product. Okay? That's my dog, Mika, by the way, at Christmas. She's being very festive, wearing a wreath. So let's, um, let's start from the beginning. So before you start editing, I like to click on the Done in the top left. And then you can just quickly name your movie by typing on it. So just call it Mika Puppy, done. And you see in the bottom left, you see this little play sign. You can just play it without the ability to edit. Banana? So you know what it looks like. I can put peanut butter in the end. Um, or you can do in the center there, which is where you save the video when you're done. You have to translate the video. Like once you're done editing, you have to hit this center button, push save video, and that'll put it in a format that you can then upload to YouTube and everything. So let's click on the edit button here. We'll go in. I'm not gonna get too fancy here, I'm just keeping this simple. This is what we have, this is the video we have. It's 14 seconds long. Um, the bottom right corner here, little wheel. You can change it to comic or whatever, You know, give it a certain look, blockbuster, and you can also have it fade in from black or fade out. So when you're set, hit done, you'll see it looks a little bit different now, right? Um, let's say that we want to add something to it because you're gonna you're gonna have multiple things that you add into this. Unless you're so good that you can do everything, you know, from the get go, uh, you could also shorten it if you highlight it and you see how see the numbers underneath Mika Puppy. See how the numbers are changing. 14 seconds, 13, you can be making it shorter, making it long, as long as it is, or whatever. Um, so let's say we do this, but right here we want to add a photo. So we see this little plus sign to the left? We click on that plus sign, and we can go into photos then, and we can add, let's add one of these Portland, Oregon photos. Now you can see the plus sign will, I'll go into that in a minute. The three dots, you want to click that, and you can do cutaway, which is what this looks like. It'll just, it'll cut away to the photo only, but you can still hear the audio. The apple. No, I don't have apple. What do you want me to say? See, and just the length of the photo, you can make it shorter, you can make it longer, it doesn't matter. So whenever the photo length is done, it goes back to the original photo. See that? 
back and to the left back to the left <laughs> all right anyway all right so let's cut away i'm just going to go over these quickly so that you get an idea plus sign uh, let's do a different photo it's this uh, beautiful portland oregon here uh, i'm in detroit but um, part oregonian part michigander picture in picture this is where you'll see both pictures. You can, you know, obviously select the right thing. You can move it around wherever you want. You can resize it by shrinking it with your fingers, whatever. Get rid of the border. Right, and it'll stay up there for yeah. the duration well, of the clip. So once what you see it physically end, that's where it ends in the video. All right. Let's delete that. We'll do one more. And let's do Hollywood Theater. Three dots, right? And split screen. Now, this will put both images up at the same time. So we play it at the same time. You can also do video instead of photos. So you can have two videos technically playing at the same time. It'll automatically default to this. This is the main one that I'm highlighting here. So that will always get the higher volume. You can adjust that, and I'll show you how in a second. Let's go back. We'll click the plus sign. We'll go back, back, back till we get to this core thing. We'll add audio, my music, songs. Let's just pick one, hit that plus sign, it puts it right underneath, okay? So now this is what it'll sound like with... I don't have apple, I have banana, apple. I can put peanut butter on the apple. No, I don't have apple, what do you want me to say? Okay, so um, one more thing. Let's say you want to, you like the beginning, but you want it to stop right here, and you want it to go to something completely different, so... You highlight this and you click split at the bottom. That splits these two. So whatever one you highlight, then you can delete if you just click delete. So let's say it ends right there at 2.8 seconds. But you want to do something else, so you go back. Let's go back to the video. Video parts. Okay, so now let's add in a different video. Um, and you click. Now, you can play this. Uh you can click the plus sign and what that will do is it'll create another a video but it'll be on the main line so here let me get the plus see what i'm saying it goes down to the main line that's what the plus sign is for so um now you can add say photos on top of that anything that's on the main line you can add a photo of right you can do just uh Let's do split screen. So anything that's on the main line is the main one, the one that's highlighted. And then anything above it is something that's sharing space with that main one. So you can only have one main one, but you could have a split screen on top. Do you see? Does that make sense? Um, so that's how you add things. And let's say you wanted this to end here. You split that off. You can you can also take this and and drag it if there's a space up in between these two. So you can have that come first, and then you could go to this. Does that make sense? You could also take this, uh, my puppy here, and move that over here, just drag it. That's it. So now you've got a I split screen of the same puppy. It. Okay, so let's say you're all done. You've done all the stuff. You've added to it. That's what you want. You've, you've you've got two hours or whatever you got on there. I don't know if it does two hours, but it should. Click done. Okay, you've got that. Hit the little middle button there. Now you want to save the video. Click save. Now, while this is exporting, you can't do anything with your phone. You have to just let it export before you do anything. You can't check your text, nothing. Just let it do it. Depending on how long it is, it doesn't take very long. Um, and then it will export it in a format that uh, is uploadable to other places. All right, so we did all that. We've edited it. Now, let's say we want to do a YouTube. I said YouTube, not a YouTube. Click this little plus sign down here, whatever your, whatever your account is. Upload a video. Select the one that we just made. Just edited this. Uh, and then this is where you add a title, description, and you click on upload, and it'll upload it to YouTube. That's it. That's all you have to do. And, you, you know, if you want to do it to, to Instagram, it's the same thing. You just click on the plus sign, uh, post, and 
there's your video once you play it. Get it right size there. There you go. That's it. That's all you got to do. And that's it. That's all you got to do. Easy, right? Just keep making them and you'll get a feel for the style and what you're trying to do and maybe have like a map beforehand or just go with it, whatever you want to do. And make sure you watch the later videos so that you know how to do two movies at once and split screens and picture in picture and all those different colors and adding subtitles and photos and, and um, you know, all music and all different kinds of things. So check those later videos out. Subscribe here so that you don't miss anything. Like and subscribe, share it if you can, and if you want to support further, patreon.com slash rdos43. All right, get to work, get it out there, and remember, just keep going.